Hello, and welcome back to the Lila Place on the Edge server, because we're back. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So, I did some work t the other day, and I might have finished a good chunk of my exterior. And along with it, let me go up my stairs here. Do, 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 do. Along with that, a good chunk of my roof, which I'm frankly rather pleased by. I was originally going to do the roof in crimson, but I don't have any crimson wood yet, so I decided to try the mangrove, and I think it actually works out quite well. And going back inside, as you can tell, I've done a little bit of just very simple putting some things out. I'm thinking I'll make this entire area my storage. And then now that I have this roof on, I'm not sure what I'm going to do. I have this lovely turret of, if you will. I'm thinking I will add a floor and make this some other storage, maybe even make that my actual bedroom. Um, but for the moment, I have this lovely wide open space with a pretty nice view, all things considered. So I'm not sure yet what ceiling I'm going to do. I might just keep it the crimson and just put some nice planks around. Um, if I do make this a room, that means I either need to add some ladders or stairs. I'm thinking I don't want to do stairs because that takes up space. I'm thinking I'll do polish and a site full floor. I don't know. Anyhow, I got that much done. I'm going to check over at my shops in a moment because I, I haven't finished them, to be honest. I still need to finish the acacia and dark oak stuff. Restock anything that needs to get restocked. Look at it. And I need to finish, <laughs> finish the dark oak area. So let's go check out the shops and see how that's looking. So far, all I know of is my shop, and then Disco has a place now. So that's Disco's over yonder, which I'll need to go check out soon. Also, I love how he's using lava as a light. I fully approve of this. You can see some of this is, is done on the exterior. Some of it still needs a bit more uh, work, and I should not walk in here with an axe in my hand. I have learned before. That is very dangerous. I'm putting in my chest a little bit of extra leftover stuff. So if people are like, hey, we want to test something, see if we like how this looks, or anything of that nature, they can test out a piece of furniture and see, does this work in their base? Does this not work in their base? That kind of a thing. So... I actually made some diamonds the other day. I was not expecting that, so now I'm like, oh, maybe I need to actually be checking this on the regular, because, hey, that was not what I was planning or expecting, and I do need to finish all that, too. So let's throw this in here fast. Wait, here we go. So I'm having every single room here be unique to the wood, as I described in my first episode, which is fantastic. I really like this idea. I think it works pretty well all things considered but that also means I need to make sure I am fully decorating as needed for this because that makes a difference you know also I have the problem of that is where I was originally gonna have the store go to and I'm wrapping up that way and going across so we'll see when I actually reach that spot it might take some time no, you know what? Actually, I'm going to go ahead and do... Yeah, I'm going to do this instead. I'm going to go with that, I think. Yeah, that's going to be dark for the ceiling, but it is what it is, and that's fine. So let's quickly get this shop up to uh, snuff, and maybe we'll go mining. Because I have not been mining at all yet, and I, I need to get my own get my own stuff for my own mining. I, I am very thankful for server mates who have uh, been very gracious in sharing stuff, but it's high time I go get my own stuff too, you know? A logger has to have some amount of pride. 
pride and ownership, you know? So I think we're going to do that next. After we get our shop fully up to snuff, that'll be good. That'll be very good. Oh, that already looks so much more polished. Mmm, me gusta. Let's do this. I don't mind putting that one there. And I'll need another the problem is right now, I am actually getting hungry. <laughs> Why am I getting hungry? I don't want to be hungry. I had a full dinner too. Okay. I think this shop is basically as good to go as it's gonna be. Um it's going to be extended in the future. Once I get warped wood and I get crimson wood, then I'll be able to have this probably go up to, I don't know, maybe crimson to warped, just to go from this to that. Um, I'm not sure yet, but we'll see. As it is though, this part is done. I'll do the ceiling and this once I know what I'm going to be blending up to, but here we have our acacia, the dark oak. This room is so dark. I might get another lantern actually and put another lantern up there just because it feels so dark. Or maybe I'll get a chain and hang a chain or something for that. That'd be that'd look good. Jungle. I just I love the way I love this red. This shade is beautiful to me. And even though I'm not a fan of this style of birch, I do appreciate the brightness and lightness of this. Like something about those two work really well together. Like, I don't know. I'm pleased. I am very pleased. So I have the roof done up here and it's done up there. And that one up there. And once I get to over the edge, once I get to over here, you can kind of see part of what's up there already. Um, assuming I make it work the way I'm thinking, it'll be out on the other side as well. And when it's out there, I'm going to need to make sure I have my um, roof there too. But once that's there, it's done. My shop is done, 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 done. I am very excited over this. And I mean, it's a simple shop. All I need to do is make sure I grind and have extra wood on hand for that. Like, that's that's no big deal, really. That's really easy for me to do, just to grind and collect wood and logs and all the things in between. Like, that's that's easy for me. So I am a little disconcerted with the drop that's here for Disco, but, you know. This is Disco's shop, which... Bricks from below, disco. I I'm a big fan, honestly, of this aspects of home. Although I do have to admit my amusement that he does have the lava behind things or something like uh. But blackstone, salt, uh. I don't know. This is very cozy. I I love it. It me a little homesick to be honest it really does but I am very happy to be here above world and as long as I can avoid the rain and the water we're doing pretty good I think I know at some point we're going to uh potentially open this up and widen this to make it look a lot nicer for coming to the shopping district but that'll be another project another day not today Today, I, I know I need to go mining. I really need to mine and grind, and I just realized there's this lovely little windowsill, and I kind of want to go find flowers to put there for Disco, just because I can. So if we find flowers, we're going to put some there just because we can. Hee <laughs> hee. Don't go in the water. All right, so I want to... I've been, I have two waystones, actually, that have been delivered to me. So I'm thinking I need to take those and go adventuring and see if I can find a good spot to go mining so I don't have to worry about stripping resources here where everyone else is gathered. I really don't want to do that, but I really need more resources. 
I'm also really a fan of Welder's Mailbox. I'm kind of thinking maybe I should put a mailbox there too. It just seems like a really good idea to emulate. Please delivery box. Let's see here. Oh, that's not bad. I actually really like the way that light blue looks. Okay. Okay, like, because that's not as um, sharp on the eyes as the... Uh, as this white is. I feel like this white is really sharp, especially contrasting with that. But, oh! Oh, that makes such a good difference! <gasps> okay. Okay, so light blue dye with the ink is my new favorite thing ever. Okay, that's excellent to know. I don't know. Do I want to do red glass on my windows? I don't know if that would be, like... Kind of on the creepy side, or if that would look good. I mean, it would kind of go with, you know, the mangrove and all that. I feel like that'd be a nice thing, but maybe it'd be too, I don't know, bloody vampire? I don't know, like, but it's white, it's bright, it's not that kind of a creepiness, and I think it could maybe work, or maybe... Maybe tie in that little bit of light blue and do like light blue. This is a hard choice for me, guys. So, even note in the comments if you have an opinion on what I should do in this regard, because I'm really not sure. I could see a good argument for both. I mean, honestly, I'll probably either post a poll later before this episode, like long before this episode is ever out, or I'll just quiz my server mates for ideas. But. Hey, 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 I was going to sleep through the night. I was going to do that. So we really need to have a desert that we can take all our resources and stuff from. But you know what? This seed, there's like no deserts nearby. They are forever far away. So I'm going to try bravely going where no one has gone before to put a waystone down. So at least I can easily travel to and from the desert, and then others can travel there eventually and smack that waystone, and they can go to and from the desert. Will I survive my trek to this desert? Probably not. But we'll try! <laughs> we will try! <laughs> what makes me nervous is all the snow. I'm like, powdered snow is now a thing, and knowing my luck actually may put that in my hands as well. So if I fall in, I can theoretically... Dig my way out! This is exactly what I was afraid of. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Um. Mm, is this also powdered snow? Oh! Oh! That's deep snow! Oh, gosh! Oh, no, 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 no. That is... That is deep, deep, deep. No leggy, no leggy, no, no laggy. Bad, 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 bad. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Nope. Nope. Don't like that. Don't, don't like that. We'll go around. <laughs> we'll go around and we'll grab some extra dirt while we're at it. And um, um, we will make ourselves a path to, to that because I would like to raid this actually. Um, I also do not wish to die because I'm sorry, but death by snow? No, oh, thank you. That sounds awful. Absolutely awful. That though. Yep, yep, yes please, thank you. That whole thing. Add it. Take that too. So I can use some of that. Goodness. Where'd the other one go? I know there were two. Yoink, no! Mm. Take it. One way or another. Seriously. Okay, I got it. <laughs> cool. Alright, alright. Now then, and hopefully for up here, that means then that uh, we'll be safe 
from rain. Hopefully, theoretically, I'm just gonna blaze my way this way because I, I, I have trust issues with this snow right now. And yeah, I, I'm not feeling the need or desire to freeze to death. That's not natural for a Blazeborn to freeze to death. And nope, no thank you. No thank you. No, 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 Am I still... Oh. It's terrifying. Am I still dying though? How am I still dying? I shouldn't be. I should be... I should be free. I hate powdered snow so much. So much. You have a long way to go if you think there's a desert this way. It's a long path. I've been looking at the uh, seed map, and it's all the deserts are super far away. It'd be faster to travel through the Nether and build yourself a portal. That would require me to have diamond tools to get me obsidian for that. Okay. What have you been doing? Not mining. What? If ah, you builders. Yeah. I did I today, that. though, go out to where Toast and I are going to be basing and made myself a mine there. So I will start mining Pretty soon, yeah. but ooh, giant hole! Oh, that I'm gonna go <laughs> cry. I don't have wings. Sephiroth Jackson. Did you say I'm gonna go cry? <laughs> no, I'm gonna go around. Mm-hmm. That's what I said. I have a very long path ahead of me. Enjoy. Have fun. <laughs> Thanks. Here, have some jerky. Ooh, jerky! Thank you. I genuinely appreciate that. I don't think I have anything else on me that would be useful. <laughs> I have a bow, but it has literally uh, three uses on it, so... All I have is roses. I did actually get some of those. Okay. So long as you have some. Yeah, truly. <laughs> That's all we need for the season for you. Have fun. Good luck. See yous! Now we are off on our own again and going to try to not die. Try being the keyword. Ice. Lovely. No, 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 no. Okay. Okay. Fine. We're gonna be fine. Gonna be fine. This actually work. Uh, that kind of works. Ugh. This is so not gonna work. <laughs> This is only going to last for so long. I do not remember how friendly polar bears are or not. That is gorgeous. My dudes, we made it. I found us the desert and the mesa. And it's gorgeous. There's so much sand that we can use for our top secret project of which we are having a base buddy this season. And we have plans! So many plans. I hope our schedules will allow the plans. But we have plans! <laughs> we have so much sand here for all those plans that we're thinking of. And we have all this amazing terracotta that we can use as well. Like, oh my goodness. I am excited. Like, it's gonna be nighttime. That's gonna be exciting. But, I mean, just check it out. This thing goes so far, it goes way yonder that way, it goes across that way. There's even more desert stretching all across that way. It is fantastic. So I'm pretty excited and I have now set down this here leveredly waystone so I can easily get back here as often as needed. And look at the beautiful moon. Isn't it lovely? It's white and clear and gorgeous. So I think that's a good place to stop. Probably. We'll see. 
So thank you again for coming with me on this trek across so many blocks. I want to say I'm... Oh, goodness. Some... 5,000 plus blocks away from the spawn. <laughs> Thank you for joining me on that very arduous trek. I chopped out a lot of superfluous fluff so that way you didn't have to be completely stuck with all the blah of it all in the travel. But we have made it. We are here and it is lovely and... I'm going to have some new stuff to show you, I think, next time. We'll have to see how that goes. Check out Red's VOD if you can from this last uh, Sunday. We were doing some ABBA mining, and it was fantastic, by the way. So check that out. And in the meantime, have a lovely day. I hope it's a fantastic one, and I'll see you later. Bye! Okay. So, since I've given you a friendship pass to Monopoly Mountain here, I need your shoes. Okay. <laughs> 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 oh, he wants your shoes. <laughs> and then I will give you my shoes, and there, we will have traded shoes. <laughs> This just makes my heart far too happy. Okay.